It's not Mexican Independence Day like many people think, but rather Cinco de Mayo is a holiday commemorating the Mexican Army's unlikely victory over French forces at the Battle of Puebla in 1862, May 5th, 1862. But the holiday has grown in popularity, not just celebrated by Mexicans anymore, but by people around the nation and the world. A celebration of Mexican heritage and pride. And how could one describe Mexican heritage? Well, festive is a good word. Food, dance, and lots of music. But during this week of Cinco de Mayo, people can find the Mexican cuisine and live mariachi band right here at the Hyatt. The band brought in specifically for this Mexican fair. Joe Arias is the leader of the band Mariachi de Alma from Los Angeles. Why is it uh, such a part of the culture? Um, mariachi music started in a little town of Cocula in, in, uh, near Guadalajara in the state of Jalisco. Uh, that's the same place where the chef is from here at the Hyatt for this promotion. Uh, and through like the mid-1800s to current time, it's evolved from a small little village group to what it is today. We're almost like symphonic players in, in some respect. Why is it so synonymous with the, the food? And is it part of the culture eating just as much as it is the music and the... Yeah, well, you know, the people of Mexico love to fiesta or party. So kind of the music goes hand in hand with the, the culture and the cuisine. And so it really makes the food taste so much better. Oh, yeah, because, you know, <laughs> tequila, music, food, you know, what, what more could you want? And all that you will find at La Merienda at the Hyatt with a special Mexican cuisine, which will be available for lunch and dinner. Chef Rafael Camarena will feature some of his authentic Mexican dishes. We're going to pre prepare here enchiladas, lamb, and red sauce. With this, also with this sauce, the lamb, uh, carnitas, is pork, pork braised, and a lot of appetizers like ceviche, uh, sopes. What's your favorite? My favorite probably is uh, chile rellenos. And what is that? Chile rellenos is like a uh, pasilla, fresh pasilla, or poblano, stuffing with cheese inside. And then it's deep fried. And it's kind of deep fried, yeah. Deep fried. Oh. That's one of my favorites. Chef Rafael has picked up recipes from his travels around the world, but he says much of his knowledge he's gained from his mother right in her home kitchen. You enjoy making Mexican Yeah, I really enjoy to make this. Eh? Does it, it bring you back home to your mom's kitchen when you're starting? Yes. To, so a lot of your recipes come from where? where from everywhere, but most from South Mexico. From, most from Guadalajara, Jalisco. And a lot of them, you, you take from your mom's kitchen. Yes, it? I take from my kitchen a few recipes too. So authentic. For the whole family.